Can you see? <clears throat> this trail was right up behind the house. Uh, it is actually, you know, a pretty steep climb. But, and on bad days I can't climb it because I have, uh, as of last summer, a baker cyst behind my left knee. It acts up now and then. This last time it was my right leg, but the whole leg was swollen. So I guess it was water retention that made it where I couldn't, you know, hardly walk at all. What I am going to do here soon, let me uh, bring this forward a little bit so you can see. What I am going to do here before too long is get myself another GoPro with a head strap. And that way, anytime I come back to the woods, I'll have it on and, you know, that'll be that. Over here, not quite sure what spot was a dogman structure. And I know it was a dogman because I took a picture of its footprint. And it had the claws up top, up front, or up at the top. And uh, it was... Uh, and then the pads in the back, but it was like a, I don't know, six, seven inches. It was pretty big. You know how, and, and you could tell that it was basically walking on its toes. And I can only assume that's how dogmen do. Yeah, I'm not quite sure where that structure is now. And when it gets green, it's really hard to, you know, see through here. But anyway, I'm going to go back to the house and get Robert to bring me back, all the way back in the back. Like I said, this trail is directly behind the house up the hill uh, I had a briar sticking to me get the hell off anyway <clears throat> this is uphill a little bit too but not too bad I love love this trail for walking um, and I always half expect when I'm walking up here that there will be a mountain lion or a, you know, we have a black cat, it's actually a black cougar, and we, brought, we got pictures of it sunning and there's a valley down there, open fields Robert Mose. Um, <coughs> We have a picture of him when he was a cub, and he was down there sunning, and when he saw us, he just got up and pretty as you please, slow as you please, walked back into the woods like we wasn't nothing, and then a couple of boys hunted back, you know, not on our property because we don't allow hunting. But anyway, they hunted back there and uh, they came running up to the house telling us that there was a panther that had just walked across our valley. And so it's gotten bigger, <laughs> which I'm okay with. But anyway, I'm going to see if he'll take me back. I'll upload that video and this one. And the last one. So, I'll talk to y'all later. 